Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we are in Tampa because Jason is on a work trip. He's been here for about a week and we decided to come visit him the last week. So right down the road from our hotel is a container store and I have to go get Allison some new lunchboxes containers. She already has a lunchbox but I need to get her lunchbox containers because her lunchbox last year it was sideways and this year it is um like taller so I need to get containers that stack or something I don't know we're gonna go in and look and see what they have Sophia has the the long way I don't even know how do you explain it but anyways she has like the flatter um, lunchbox like she did last year so she really doesn't need any containers but we're gonna go ahead and take a look anyway so I wanted to take you guys along with us and see what they have let's go Okay, so already walking into the store, I can see everything that I want. <laughs> they had so much stuff here, obviously. Um, I love to organize, if you guys don't already know that. I have a huge pantry that I would love to continue to organize, um, but I'm not sure if we are going to be staying in our home for very long, so I'm not gonna be doing anything to it, but if I were to move, I would come here for sure and buy most of my organization stuff. A lot of this stuff I have no clue what it is, but a lot of it I do know what it is, self-explanatory, but I will probably be going through it with you guys anyways. So let's get started. So when I came to the store, I went to the right hand side and most of this stuff is drawer organizing for, you know, your underwear and socks and things like that. These are look like buckets for underneath your bed or to store in your closet and then they also have buckets that you can store your shoes in. I had no idea they had those, but I guess they do. Funny that I'm showing you guys these moth aways because my grandma used to have them in their closet and they stunk so bad. I hope that these smell better. I did not get any, but you know, when you go into your grandma's house, they smell like the mothballs. Anyways, they do have laundry detergent and fabric softener and stuff, but they're super expensive, so I don't know why anybody would buy them. But I guess if you need that special something for your clothes, you can get them here. And then they also have more baskets and storage units. If you're big on makeup, this is the perfect place for you. They have all of these cute little drawers and makeup holders, super cute, and keep your stuff organized. I thought this potty pack was so funny. It's a traveling toilet kit, you get a seat, cover, um, I believe some wipes and things like that. So funny. And then these Raymond notes. So cute. I should have gotten that for Allison. And then they also had some cute little gizzards and gadgets. This is my favorite place, of course, because they had all the cute little things that you need for your home and your desk area. If I had a kid's toy room, I would totally get these buckets. Look how adorable they are. They have cute little wheels and the wheels actually work. Sophia loved them. But anyways, we are back over to the bedroom area where you can get these cute little mini box sets. This one I thought was really cute because you can pull it down and you to store it, you can push it up and it makes it very small. So I thought that was pretty cool. They also have these little drawers for kids rooms and these Lego storage cases, which I thought were pretty cool because if you guys know we went to Lego land and started collecting some Lego figures that would be perfect for this now to all the kitchen stuff which is my favorite you have the containers to put your sugars and flour and things like that in your sauce packs and stuff like that I love these organizers for the spice cabinet, but I really love this one because you can put it in the corner. You don't see too many like this, so I love that. And then they also have freezer and fridge bins, soda bins, and this is so cute, the salt and pepper bin. 
adorable. You could take it camping with you. And I love this honey jar. Now on to the lunch supplies. I love this area. This is the reason why I came here. I wanted to find some containers for the girls for the new school year. So this is what we're looking at now. I love all the snack boxes and the lunch boxes here. This I thought was super cute, the condiments, um, but they are a little bit too big for the kiddos. So I didn't end up getting any of those, but I did get Allison a few of these lunch box kits. This is all the reusable section. They have bags and paper sandwich bags if you would like to use those for lunches this year. They also had these cute little bags. It looks like a garbage bag, but it's not. It, it is a reusable bag. And then they also had reusable spoons and forks for your lunchbox. And of course my favorite, the OXO, I'm not sure how you say the name, containers are my, my all-time favorite. And this is super cute. If your dishwasher is no longer working to tell you that it's done, that little magnet tells you it's clean or not clean. And these I thought were so cute. They meow and they move. <laughs> and finally, to finish off my shopping, they had these cute little zip ties for bags. How cute are these? Okay, so I'm back from the container store and I didn't buy much, obviously. I was just kind of looking for some things for um, Allison's lunches and this is exactly what I wanted and what I found. Um, these, I bought three of them. They do have a snap here and then when you open it up, you have two compartments here, which I can use um, some of those cups to make more compartments if need be and then up here it opens up as well like Sophia was showing you in the store and you could put a sandwich here or you could put pasta salad here anything like that and you just take this flap and close it up and it holds everything together I would not put any like big liquids or anything because it will spill over to the bottom so that is what i bought for three of the, i got three of those they were 5.99 each i also needed some more reusable straws so i picked these up because i really like the rainbow colors and then sophia picked up this gl uh, drinking glasses so let's give them a try put them on for me all right okay show me how it works so you have one straw in your mouth, the other straw goes into your drink container, and you drink out of it. <laughs> That's so cool. She's always wanted one of these, so I'm like, whatever. <laughs> So anyways, guys, I wish I had a better haul for you, but unfortunately I don't because I don't really need containers. When we move, I will definitely get you guys um, a better haul of containers and stuff like that, but for now, that's what we've got. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this tour of the container store. If you did, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and we will see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.